This is what happens if you take drugs. You see that? I don't think you understand how hard it is to drive when this is going on. You can't get to your destination. You're not going to arrive. You're not going to get there. You're going to fucking run off the road thinking the fucking square was coming right for you. Because it is coming for you. You and you. Especially you. Yeah. There were three headed sharks on the TV a minute ago. I mean, I seen the sharks. I wasn't thinking much about it. And then I saw Machete was driving the boat. I was like, oh man. That's Machete. Machete. Machete's a great. Greatest fucking. You know, since. Since the New World Order is taken over, I can just stand. I don't feel Rambo. I don't feel Schwarzenegger. I don't feel even the guy from Transporter. Maybe him. Jason Statham. Great hero. Very professional in his whooping of ass. People like that. They like you to be all in a suit. Fucking shit up. So I'm going there. And I'm seeing the TV's got shark. But then the shark jumps up. This motherfucking shark's got two heads. It's three-headed shark. The fucking shark has three heads. Machete was shooting at it. Some infinitely amount of bullets until finally he just threw the gun at the uh, I don't know why and then he opened up the glove box what's inside a fucking machete some things you just can't go wrong with machete's one of those things because the, he is the right amount of retardedly ludicrous to put into a situation that doesn't make any sense They've tried this a few times with the movies, and they're great. I don't know what they're about. But they're usually there's titties and then machete. This concept was popularized and, and by the science fiction TV show Stargate. And as recently as 2015... Spoiler alert. Stargates are now being activated. Watch out, Whopper. Stargates are open and closing. Don't drive through one. When you go through a Stargate, you need to take the change out of your pockets. Because that change heats up as you're going through the gate thing. You don't, you don't, you know, you don't notice it. It's not like sliders where y'all fucking pop out and it's like a fucking slide. No, 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 no. No, you walk like you're normally walking and it trans-dimensionally relocates your ass. Except when you see all the lights going by like in Star Wars when they fucking warp. That's heating up your change, and that's going to burn your legs. So take it out. Be safe. It's a simple thing to do. Put it in the tray. Maybe they'll have one. I don't know. I haven't, I haven't been invited yet. I have to guard the gateway area. What do you do? You sit at home and you fucking... You do your day job and guard the gate? Yeah, yeah. Why not? I mean, because entities have to come and they have to come and and seek passageway from the lo the local gateway shaman type. They can't just go through there. It doesn't work. They have to have the guy turn the rock that activates it. He's not going to do that for some entities. It's not going to happen. It's not happening. Plus, I'm American, so you keep your fucking Chinese troops the fuck away from the Stargate, Chinaman. I can't just trust you, Chinaman. A five-year-old child tells me I know two things, said Dad. I don't like hobos, and I don't like Chinamen. Like, what in the fuck? You are five years old. What in the hell? Who in the hell has taught you this? Fucking some weird shit. You, you come with it, you just don't... 
let go in your multiple incarnations. You hold on to it like a fucking, like a squirrel holds a nut. Like a raccoon holds that shiny thing. I don't let go. You can't. You have them trapped just there to fucking art. It's like us. We're here down here. We're holding the shiny thing. We don't even know fucking that we're connected to something else. Don't forget. Fuck, I don't remember. I'm sure I've been around for the same 13 point some odd billion fucking years. All these particles have been here. That make me up. So I've been here. In different forms. I'm sure. I don't, I don't know. I'm not going to tell you I was fucking Genghis Khan or, or um, the Russian guy with the crazy eyes. Definitely that guy. Because that's so highly unlikely. People always want to be somebody from the past life they know. Like, you know, the Lone Ranger or some fucking, some badass from back in the day. No. Motherfucker, you was on the farm. Nobody knew you and you died. How many times nobody says that? Nobody says they're that guy. Who the fuck wants to be that guy? Nobody. That's just food for thought. Take the change out of your pockets.